Pastor Edgar Aaron has enjoyed some of Bermuda. Now, Bermuda, it's time for us to enjoy the ministry of this man of God. See you tomorrow, February 9th at 11 a.m. Let's worship God together. I got to come back another time. It'll be over. Hallelujah. Many of the afflictions of the righteous, but it'll be over in a minute. Come on. Hallelujah. If you just hold out and trust him in the midnight, in the middle of it, praise him in the middle of it. Come on. And you'll find that God will give you a rescue. Lift your hand and shout hallelujah. Uh, so here in the scripture text the Bible said he came walking on the fourth watch and many of you God is saying you've entered into the fourth watch you're in a period of your life where you can't see the day but you know a new day is dawn matter of fact sometimes you can be caught in the storm so long that you don't even know it's a new day that's Acts Paul he'll tell you for 14 days and 14 nights uh, all hope that we should be saved with loss uh, we couldn't even see the stars it was so dark I had to come back and talk about too dark to see the night it was so dark we couldn't see the stars up and we thought we were going to die but in the midst of the storm I come back the Bible said that God gave Paul a word and said Sarah's be of good cheer for this night I've heard from God for there stood by me this night an angel who said we're going to make it through the storm I just heard some tell your neighbor we're going to make it through the storm because some people as my pastor say uh, they don't shear the sheep but they skin the sheep uh, he taught us my pastor taught me and I thank God for him he still laughed today that when you shear sheep you take some of the wool and you leave them with some. Uh -huh. But if you skin the sheep, they won't be able to grow wool anymore and they'll go cold and hungry and so will you. Hallelujah. Uh, glory to God. Uh, you got to watch people to try to skin you alive uh, and take everything out of you and from you. Uh